nothing surprised me at this point that I've seen him do because I've seen him do it when he was younger. When nobody else believed in him, I always believed in him. You know, I'm the one he told his dreams to. I'm the person who he said, Mama, you think I could do this? Mama, you think I could do that? And I've always told him, you could do whatever you want to do. Man didn't make you and man can't break you. Draymond Green's path to stardom has been plagued by criticism and doubt. Few believe that a scrappy kid from Saginaw, Michigan could make such a dramatic impact playing professionally in the NBA. And now I talked to his teacher because I work with one because I'm an officer at the school. And his teacher, old teacher comes up to me, she said, you know, I wish I would have kept that project that Draymond had. And I'm like, what project? She said, this boy told me that he was going to play in the NBA and I told him to come up with a realistic goal. He said it is realistic. I put it on paper, didn't I? And that's how he looked at it. It's really funny because that 2012 draft um, the Warriors had four picks and they didn't think they wanted all of them because they were already a really young team. What they really wanted to find was an alpha. They knew that Stephen Curry was a star, but he was kind of a quiet star, a leader by example. They wanted an alpha. And who's that guy at 35? We get, what's that guy's name? What, Draymond Green? The Golden State Warriors select Draymond Green. So for them to find at 35 this alpha and people were ready to listen to him, that was a very unique thing. He's taken off from there. So if you're going to bet on a person and you know talent level is close, you're going to bet on the person you think is going to work harder to get better. I'm not going to sit here and pretend I knew exactly that this is what Draymond Green would be like. I had no clue he would be this good. But we all knew that he would make it in the NBA. He, he's too tough to fail. It hasn't been easy for Draymond Green. From high school, to college, to the NBA, he's had to constantly work hard to prove to the world that he belongs to be there. Regardless of what it is, if you put in the work, the steps are already, the steps have already been put out there for you. Just do your part. So that's where my other quote came in from. It was scripture, man that don't work, don't eat. So if you work hard, you can be anything you set your mind to be. Draymond has so much heart and determination and it overcomes whatever size limitations uh, he may have. You know, I am surprised. If I was to be very honest about it, I didn't think he could make this kind of track so fast. He grew in leaps and bounds, and what he's done is he keeps growing as a player, but now he's even doubling that as a person. I love his competitiveness, but he's got a very gifted basketball mind. He's a step ahead of everyone. That's what gives him his edge when he's playing against bigger, stronger people. He's just truly competitive. He's one of my favorite players in the league. It's been a long journey for Draymond, from being picked in the second round to being an NBA All-Star. Draymond Green proved that heart trumps height. Do what's your part, work hard, and you'll make it. So now, you know, my little quote where I got, eat Dre, I put it over everything, eat Day Day, you know? And that's just him eating because he worked hard. You deserve whatever it is you set out to do when you work hard at it.